Hello everybody, Berto Guy here and welcome back. Alright, so we're going to be playing an early access game called Satisfactory. I'm pretty sure most of the people have already heard it because it's already been out for a little while now. Uh, this game is pretty, pretty dope, man. I'm looking forward to playing this uh, on my good computer. Like this awesome, awesome beast. So we're just going to call this uh, Berto Guy. How's that? That sounds good. Yeah, let's start. So I think I resolved the issue with the 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 echo in my video that I noticed and that I've been trying to get rid of. I'm pretty sure I got rid of it anyways. Oh yeah, here we go. So let's see how this goes. Fingers crossed. Attention. Yeah, but I like Attention the details. Pioneer. This looks so nice. The following instructional video is a summary of your impending ah. duties as an exoplanetary pioneer for Fixit Incorporated. People keep texting me. Fix it crazy, pioneers crazy, have three crazy morning. 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 Chart the planet and gather resources to provide desired results and improve your infrastructure. Make sure to report any unusual discoveries to R&D for analysis. <laughs> right into his Expand pants. your factories, outposts, and pipelines through automation and augmentation. Oh, I plan on it. That's it. Get to work and be effective. Excellent. Your I like the detail in this game. Imminent. It's very nice. And that poster. I want to get closer to that poster. I'd like to see what's on it. Nice flamage. What are going down? What are going down, Captain? Oh, no. Oh, yeah. shaking pretty good. Looks like uh, the structural integrity will hold. I don't know. I hope so. <laughs> that would really suck. Oh, beautiful. I know this spot. Very easy to get to where I want to go. Nice little starter off space. Excellent. Please ensure the integrity of your multi-purpose exploration suit is at 100%. I will. Bam. Remember, efficiency ah. first. Godspeed. Yes. Oh, uh, that's cool. I, I was wondering what that was. It's a little sticker with a happy face at the bottom of it. It was kind of like falling off and... They go and they rub Welcome it right back on. That's sharp. A, B, That's cool, your man. Your designated sector in the binary star system of Akicha. Akicha. I am Ada. Also Hello, known Ada. as an official directory and assistant, tasked to support pioneers such as you in their mission. You hmm. are the third of your sector to survive planetfall. Congratulations. Right. Thank you. Note: Objective-based introduction initialized. Welcome to onboarding. Oh, the floor is really nice. Looks so nice. First objective. Please dismantle mm. the drop pod. The resulting okay. materials will be repurposed to construct Done. a habitat and utility base from now on referred to as the hub. No, we gotta collect Fix leaves and stuff. It is cost effective and efficient. We do not waste. Alright, alright. It's good. That's this good. consumable possesses minor healing properties. Further analysis required to establish object scanner identification. All right, all right. Anything else? Second Anything objective. Else? Please ensure you have your Fixit Incorporated ah, right. Zeno Zapper equipped before leaving the drop zone. Sweet. Note, according to Fixit regulations, every pioneer should have access to a means of defense against extraterrestrial threats. Sounds good. All right, she done. Third objective. No. Please familiarize yourself with the resource scanner to find iron. Okay. Note: the acquisition of iron is considered essential in preparation for all future objectives. Yeah, I figured that. Okay, so I'm gonna.
Okay, dokie. So everything was fine. Uh, all the audio was fixed. I don't have that horrible echo in the background anymore, and we are we're safe to go. We're safe to continue on with the video. This is good because I think I must have redid that intro like ten times this morning. Like brutal, man. Totally brutal. Okay, so I want to go up here. Um, there's some. Uh, what is it there? There's some good iron deposits up here. They're all normal. It's pretty much all the same spot most people start because it's got a lot this of open space. This consumable possesses minor healing properties. Further analysis required to establish object scanner identification. All right. Okay, so this is going to be the initial scans reveal coloring properties in the flower petals. Further analysis required. She's so rude. She doesn't say excuse me or anything. You know, just butts in. Alright, so this is going to be our copper node. Um, is he stuck behind that rock? Yes, he was too. Awesome. Okay, so... Ada. Ada, please. I recommend analysis. Like, I'm going to start cutting you off. You know, like, it's just so ignorant of you. So this copper is going to come in handy when it comes time to um, uh, to make wires and stuff like that so as you see I've been picking up like a bunch of leaves and stuff like that that's all so we can um, make biofuels biofuels how are we gonna get the first little bit of our energy to I guess pretty much well to start our automation and that's just gonna be totally wicked now there's gonna be a few more bad guys down here that I have to uh, dispose of which is gonna be pretty great because we need uh, those carcasses in order to study them. They will get us better weapons as well. So here's this guy. Oh, totally missed. Not that time. Yeah, the jump circle thing around them works pretty good. They kind of get uh, all kerfluffled there and they have no idea what's, what's going on. So that's good. There were some more nuts over there, but just trying to clear out the area here and uh, let's go fight this guy now should be able to jump over here oh where are you going where are you going there you go that was pretty easy all right and then there's one more over here that I'd like to get rid of at least Oh crap, you actually got me. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Oh, there you are. Ah, oh, again! You're a tricky little one, aren't you? Ah. Oh. Holy crap, my timing is like right off. Come on, Burnout. There we go. There you go! That a boy! You teach him how to play this game. Alright, so. We're gonna collect this limestone here. Uh, this will help us get us concrete, which will be very good. Um, there's going to be some things I'm going to cut out a lot of. Uh, I'm not going to have to sit around and watch uh, most of the crafting and stuff like that. So, uh, yeah, uh, I guess that's pretty much all the whole gist of it. I'm not going to try to make it too boring because the crafting aspect can get really boring. Um, some of the building, too, can be a little bit tedious and boring to do on camera. Um, I'll end up probably doing like montages or something like that of crap like that of me doing um, building and uh, crafting and stuff like that just to make it a little bit more interesting as to oppose of you're always watching just me build or whatever so we're gonna go over here and get this power slug since we're here oh, uh, do the run do the run there we go so we'll get this power slug over here, and uh, she'll talk. This semi-slug seems to emit weak potential energy from its crystalline shell. Further analysis of crystals required to determine application. That should be enough for now. Alright, so eventually, like she was saying, uh, we're going to be able to analyze things, so the Point berries objective. and... Build the hub. Note, mm -hmm. to complete this objective, the resources salvaged from the drop pod will be consumed. Should have known she was gonna start talking again. So yeah, um, 
you get to scan certain things and those will give you like weapons or uh, I think one is like an inhaler and you know you get all kinds of different things like that from researching so we're gonna have to do a lot of researching too which makes the game a little bit more in depth because you do find certain things around here that you have no idea what they are and it would be good to know what they are so yeah Alright, um, I think I got enough of what I need for now, so yeah, let's put this hub down. So go to Q, and then here's your hub, this sexy thing. Alright, so yeah, put it right about here, that sounds good. So now she's going to talk again. Come on, Ada. Congratulations, Thank you. you have unlocked... Go. Hub feature, manual craft bench. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hub feature, hub terminal. Fifth objective, hub upgrade, storage and power. That's great. That's great. Thanks. Thanks, Ada. Thanks. Okay, so uh, here in the tier upgrades, uh, this is where we're going to do today. We're going to go through one to five. And the first thing we need to do is unlock the equipment workshop and the portable miner. Um, that's going to need uh, 10 iron rods. So on this crafting bench, uh, we have uh, iron. So I'm going to go ahead and just craft 10 of them just to, I guess, get it over and done with. And then kind of breeze through this a little bit so it's not so boring. And I could store some of this stuff. All right, so here... Here I forgot to select the milestone. So now you just shift click that in there, hit the hub upgrade, and now a little bit more upgraded. That's good, that's good. You got a bunch of new stuff. Congratulations. You have unlocked hub feature biomass generator. Hub feature personal storage. Scanner feature copper. Perfect. So we got a biomass burner. This is going to be uh, energy for later. We're going to end up having two of these by the time we're done. Um, so let's go see what the next thing is. Um, I think, no, actually that's wrong. That's wrong. I'm not going to see what the next thing is, burnout. You are going to go and build one of these because we want those portable miners up. So I need more rods and plates. Alright, so I went and crafted up everything we needed, um, just to not make everything so boring and watching me craft. So this is what we're going to want, is the equipment workshop. I'm going to go and slap that like right next to the uh, right next to the hub, so that way it's an easy on and off. And what we're going to need in here is portable miners. Now we only need five of these. Yeah, five. I could do all six though. But I think I just need five. We'll go with five. There we go. So what these portable miners do is obviously they mine for you, right? So we don't have to stand there and and hold the the button. We can be a little bit more a um, little bit more proactive and do other things. So let's check these things load out. These things are so awesome. They're so cool. Hello. Can you do a bunch of mining for me? Awesome. Check that out. Isn't that sweet? Those are the coolest little things ever. Alright, so let's throw another one here. So we're going to have two doing iron. We're going to have one doing the um, the limestone over here. Alright, we're over at the limestone. Throw that there. And let's run up and go to the copper. Since we're going to need a bunch of copper too, I'm going to throw two on the copper for now. And then I'm going to do another little cut, and that's going to be for going to get the, waiting for more resources so I can pretty much all do everything in kind of one little shot there, and yeah, it'll be a little bit 
a little bit better that way. So we'll just throw you here. We'll throw you here. Watch you guys unload. So wicked. That's totally boss. Oh yeah. Alright, so do a little cut and uh, I'll be right back. Okay, we're back now. So I did a little bit of crafting. Got everything I think that we're going to need for the next few little upgrades anyways. So I shouldn't have to run around so much to uh, do tier hub upgrades. So we're um, we're trying for this one. So we're going to get a little bit of extra inventory slots. Uh, we're going to be able to understand what concrete is and uh, uh, make reinforced iron plates. So yeah, that's pretty much all of that one. So. Let's put in the wire, the pipes, the plates, and we're going to get another upgrade. Awesome. And now Ada's going to have her little say again. Caution. Area under construction. Congratulations. Cool. You Thank have you. unlocked scanner stone. New buildings and blueprints, which can be found in the build menu and craft bench, respectively. Seventh objective. Hub upgrade. Conveyor belts. Note. Use power poles to expand the power network for optimal results. Note, constructors are capable of constructing copious parts, of which only one type at a time. Copious. Ooh. I think we're good? Okay, so let's go to the next one. Tier upgrade 3, we're going to get another slot. <clears throat> uh, conveyor poles, these are pretty cool. These can be adjusted height-wise. Uh, I'm going to get some foundations, which is really nice. And we're going to learn how to make biomass. So that's pretty cool. So concrete, and we need two reinforced iron plates. So that's no big deal. We have concrete on us, so concrete. I can make 87 of that. See, I couldn't do this before because we didn't unlock it. So sorry if you got to put up with a little bit of crafting. Um, it's not too long though. It only takes a, a few seconds to get through the concrete. Concrete goes pretty quick because it's a three to three to one ratio. So, <coughs> um, yeah. All right, so that's good. So in order to make reinforced plates, we're going to need some screws. Uh, we only need two of them. So there we go. And then let's do this hub. So there's. Uh, oh, you needed wire for that one. Uh, 75 plates, uh, some concrete, and those reinforced plates. Bam! Next hub upgrade. Sweet. That's looking pretty good. Congratulations. You have Thank unlocked you again. new buildings and blueprints, which can be found in the build menu and craft bench, respectively. Anything Eighth else? objective. Mm. Hub upgrade. Additional, additional power. power. Advice. When planning the construction of buildings, note the placement of conveyor belts. Caution. Overloading the power network guarantees suboptimal performance. Okay, I think she's good. Alright, so let's go for four now. So four, uh, we're just going to need some more iron plates. Uh, that's pretty good, actually. Because that shouldn't take too long to make. So, you might have to put up with some crafting. Wow, maybe. We'll see. <laughs> Alright, so, uh, iron plate, iron, gotta make the ingots first. We are not missing that many, like, we do have, um, 39 plates. So, if I just keep my finger over here. 39, we needed 75, right? I think that's what it, just, what it was. Um, I think so. So, it's only like 60-some plates. That's not bad. I'm not really... I'm just eyeballing that for... I mean, that's almost at 40, so 30-some. 30, 30... Really, it should have been like 36 plates. This should give me to 75. <clears throat> if I try to do math correctly really quick. Alright, let's see if uh, that gives us to the next tier. Oh, I had 75. I need 25 more. Oh, that sucks. I need 100. Oh, no. That's not so bad. Only 25 more. Only 25 more. We can do this. Um, like I said, once the hub upgrade is done, like it's going to be a little bit better because then we can start automating everything. And 
you're going to have everything unlocked. So it's it's much more worth it to just kind of concentrate on that. What am I doing? Um, yeah, so try to concentrate on getting your hub up as fast as you possibly can. And then once you do that, well, it's like friggin' easy peasy, man. Uh, cables and concrete. Bam. Again. Look at that. That's amazing. Oh, we get another biomass burner. You have unlocked hub feature, additional biomass generator. Nice. New buildings, which can be found in the build menu. Ninth objective, hub upgrade, molecular analysis. Note, to ensure full mastery of skills and equipment, I have been asked to not interfere with this last objective. Ah, it's about Good time. Luck. Excuse me. Uh, so now we have to do the uh, hub upgrade here. So we'll just toss those in right away. Toss those. I'll put in whatever I got here now. Um, so we're just missing 150 plates and 25 rods. Uh, 23 rods. Uh. Okay, dokey. All right. So I finished up all the um, all the plates and the rods there. So here we go, man. Upgrade. Final upgrade. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's gonna do this glitch thing again. Bam. Oh yeah. Sweet. Congratulations. You have Thank you very much, Ada. Feature, molecular analysis Check machine, this thing out. Also known as a man. Building biomass burner. Building space elevator. Equipment object scanner. Equipment beacon. Additional hand equipment slot. Motivational message. Congratulations, you succeeded That's in every awesome. provided task. On behalf of Fixit Incorporated, I thank you for your current and future service. Beautiful. Thank you, Ada. You're Additional amazing. knowledge. The hub terminal has been converted to give access to milestones there to ensure you progress along Fixit approved protocols. I think we're done now. Additionally, no. the man provides the opportunity to send samples of xenobiology and other materials I deem relevant to R&D in exchange for appropriate rewards. Note, future developments should be aimed at constructing the space elevator and thus initiating project assembly. Good luck. Okay, now that she's done babbling, um, like she mentioned here, this is the research I was talking about earlier. We're going to have to research all these things, and uh, it'll unlock more things for us to create. Uh, you, those are more of a personal basis, though, on your character. So there are things like either protection or health-wise. And, um, and the power slugs, those are for the machines, so that way you can make them run faster. All right, so now that we got our hub upgraded, that was a uh, hub one to five. That uh, really doesn't take very long, maybe an hour, like hour and a half at tops, you could dawdle. Um, but in order to get this, it doesn't take very long. Then once you get this point there, like in the beginning of the next episode, <clears throat> we're going to start automating our mining and our smeltery and all that good stuff. So, yeah. Um, thanks for watching, everybody. Peace, and we'll catch you in the next one.